I've seen a couple of posts, but how is Connor feeling? Obviously we saw him walking out limping with the crutch for a little bit. How's he feeling? How's the health? How's the leg? Um, yeah, the leg is, is okay. It's going to be a couple of days before he's walking uh, without any um, hindrance, but it, there's no serious damage. The, that um, peroneal nerve that runs down um, uh, on that side of the leg, which was kicked a number of times, it, it was completely dead. And then the, um, the legs start filling up with blood as well, restriction. So he couldn't move on it at all. It's uh, ironically, I've actually tweeted about this particular injury. It seems to be getting, um, it's popping up its head. And in a few different MMA fights, uh, it happened Chandler mm-hmm. in one of his fights in Bellator. It's happened um, Cejudo when um, uh, Demetrius kicked him there. Um, it's called a drop foot, where you just you actually can't send a signal down to your foot. You can't move it, and um, it's pretty miserable. But as of today, he's he's in good form. He did a very tough workout this morning. Um, he's already uh, looking for the next date, which we hope to get sooner rather than later. He was pressing for a busy 2020, and nothing has changed. He wants a busy 2021. So I hope um, I hope we can get the rematch. That would be the ideal. Um, if it's not that, well, then I'm not sure what it would be. Whether it's um, a different MMA fight or a boxing fight. I'm not, I'm not too sure of that. But spirits in general are very high. Um, I did a video for the, the Wimp to Warrior program. I have it on their Instagram where I spoke about um, it's, it's, it's a funny one. And he said to himself at the press conference that you don't feel, you feel upset, of course. You're disappointed. You're a competitive person. You want to win. That's the whole point of this is winning. But you can certainly live with it when you've done everything you possibly could. And it, it softens the blow.